guys, what's up? In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys my fall makeup inspired tutorial makeup group. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna stop talking now. So, the first thing that I do is moisturize my face. It's really important and also I moisturize my lips because in the fall time they tend to dry out and then it's all gross and all that. Then I prime my face with a professional primer that just evens out my skin and covers all the pores that I have. So I just blend that into my skin. Then I'm going to be covering my discolored veiny eyelids that are really just not appealing at all. And also the concealer is going to act as a base for all the eyeshadows we are going to be using today. So the first eyeshadow that I use is just a tan color to set the concealer we just put on. So you just blend that. Then I pick up a blending brush and the first eyeshadow, well the second eyeshadow we're using is just a orange tinted one. I don't know how to really explain this shade. But yeah, it's just orange and you blend it in your crease just like that you don't have to be precise at all and I feel like the more it's like like a blowed like a blowed out like style it's nicer then I went in with a brown eyeshadow and just added more depth to the eye and you are going to cut the crease girl I was so nervous during this part of the video because I never cut a crease before so this was my first time um yeah I'm, got, I'm kind of getting emotional because my first time cut crease is on camera here on YouTube and you guys are witnessing it right now. And I think I did a pretty good job. I mean, not bad. Then I added this really shimmery white pasty eyeshadow and that did not look good. So I blended it out with a tan color. And now we move on to foundation. I usually never do this, like do my eyeshadow before the foundation. But this time I was like, hey, let's try something new, you know? And I just used the Fit Me Foundation. It's from the Judd Store. Super cheap, super affordable, and it's actually really nice. It gives you that nice natural glow, as you guys can see. And now I'm concealing with the Fit Me Concealer. It's actually the best thing on earth. It's cheap as well. You know, I'm all about that cheap, inexpensive makeup product life. So I'm just using that. And to set and bake the face, we are using the LA Pro Loose Translucent Setting Powder. Now to add a little more dimension to my face, I'm bronzing with my favorite bronzer on this planet, the Hula Bronzer. I live by this product. And it just gives you the most natural, natural highlight. Uh, a highlight. What am I saying? bronze look I mean so sorry guys and also we cannot forget that jawline now going in with the rock tour blush and just blending that onto the face yeah oh and now we are dusting off the baking that we just put onto our face just dust it off girl don't poke yourself in the eye now, my favorite part guys, I brows. So the first thing that I'm doing is just brushing my little tiny brow hairs up, prepping them for the product that is about to go on my face, and I'm using the Anastasia Dip Brow. I, I just, you know, guys, this is literally the best product ever. Once you find out how to like use it and all that, I swear guys, it's the best thing ever. Then I just moved on to eyeliner. For this look, I decided to go with dramatic wing liner. I feel like when I use a lot of eyeshadow, I tend to do like a longer and more defined line. And to balance the eyeshadow look, I just blended like a dark brown eyeshadow um, on the bottom lash line and added some mascara as well. Taking my time not to poke myself in the eye. And after that, we are going to curl our top lashes. So it looks like we actually have lashes because my eyelashes are itty bitty. And I am then coating them with this Revlon mascara that is actually like really, really good. And that I like rediscovered because it was in my makeup collection for so long, but I never used it. But it's actually so good. 
Then, to finish off the look, I used this lip gloss by Tarte. It's so glossy and pigmented. Oh my god, it was so, so good. Yes. And that's the finished look, guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give the video a huge thumbs up. And also, don't forget to subscribe for more videos. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!